kids fracture bone each year. Common ways include trampolines, monkey bars, bikes, scooters, sports, and now hoverboards. We love to have fun and play, but accidents can happen. And bones can break. Let's look at Chloe's gym. <laughs> We are now putting a plaster on to help your bone heal until you see Dr. Fixit Bones. Good morning, Miss Chloe. I'm Dr. Fixit Bones. Good morning, Doctor. Could you please tell me what's wrong with my arm? So, as you can see, you have broken your arm here and here. I thought it was dislocated. No, it's fractured. A dislocation occurs at a joint. A joint is where two bones meet together and a break is in between your elbow joint and your wrist joint. This is a model of a joint. See how the bones move together. When it dislocates, it pops. You've told me that my arm is not dislocated, so is it fractured or broken? Well, did you know fractures and breaks are the same thing? broke around would this be the same no kids and adult fractures are different here is a green stick it is like a kid's bone the outer lining called the periosteum is much thicker in kids and so the bone remains partly intact when it breaks see how it's fractured but it stayed together here is a brown stick or adult bone. The periosteum is much thinner. Rock should completely snap. So doctor, how am I going to heal? Your bone will heal in four main stages. When the bone breaks, it bleeds and swells. It forms a clot called a hematoma. It swells because of the inflammation process. Cells in the blood around the fracture start to get rid of dead and damaged tissue while other cells start to help your bone heal. Immature bone forms and starts to bridge the gap between the bones. The immature bone forms into mature bone, also known as healthy bone. For a while, there is a lump around the fracture that slowly changes back into the normal bone. Now the bone has healed. Bones are really important. We need to look after our skeleton. It's vital for protection, movement and support. Let's go. Let's have fun. 